If Earth turned into a tornado, what would happen? Firstly, if Earth turned into a tornado, houses on planet Earth may keep on breaking apart. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth turned into a tornado, even the black hole may not dare to touch planet Earth. Hmm. Lastly, if Earth turned into a tornado, Earth may be left all alone. Hmm. What if Earth turned into a thunderstorm? Firstly, if Earth turned into a thunderstorm, Earth may be left all alone in the solar system. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth turned into a thunderstorm, skyscrapers could be scorched to ashes by the relentless lightning strikes. Hmm. Lastly, if Earth turned into a thunderstorm, even the largest trees on planet Earth may get reduced to ashes. Hmm. Why does Saturn have rings? Saturn's strong gravity plays a key role. When asteroids, comets, or even moons ventured too close, the immense gravitational forces tore them apart. The debris from these shattered objects, as in chunks of ice and rock, continued to collide and break into smaller fragments. Over time, this material spread out and formed the stunning rings we see today. A delicate balance of destruction and beauty orbiting the planet. Hmm. What happens if Earth started snoring? Firstly, if Earth started snoring, skyscrapers on planet Earth may keep on shaking. Hmm. Secondly, if Earth started snoring, even the trees on planet Earth may keep on shaking. Lastly, if Earth started snoring, Earth's neighbors, Venus and Mars, may also keep on shaking. Hmm. Huh? Why is Jupiter's great red spot shrinking? The great red spot was once large enough to fit three Earths inside. But it's now only the width of one Earth. Hmm. A study showed that smaller storms strengthened the great red spot causing it to grow. Hmm. Now the number of smaller storms are getting fewer and fewer on Jupiter. Hence, the great red spot is not getting enough smaller storms to feed on and grow. As a result, it is shrinking. Hmm. Huh? What is the Jupiter's great red spot? Jupiter's great red huh? spot is a giant storm that is about 1.3 times the size of Earth. It is located in the Jupiter's southern hemisphere. Winds inside the Great Red Spot can reach speeds of up to 400 miles per hour. The Great Red Spot rotates counterclockwise, indicating that it's a high-pressure system. The Great Red Spot's long lifetime may be due to Jupiter's gaseous composition and lack of a solid surface to dissipate the storm's energy. Huh? Why is Jupiter so bright? Firstly, Jupiter appears brighter when it's in opposition. During opposition, the Sun and Jupiter are on opposite sides of Earth, with Jupiter rising in the east as the Sun sets in the west. Mm. Secondly, Jupiter is covered in clouds made of methane and ammonia crystals, which reflect the Sun's light very efficiently. Lastly, Jupiter's magnetic field accelerates particles and funnels them towards the planet's poles, where they collide with the atmosphere and release energy in the form of light. Hmm. 